To rename or not to rename Marshall University's Jenkins Hall is a hot topic on campus. The building was named after a U.S. Confederate general who was from Cabell County. He owned slaves and students and staff knowing this, well, it has caused some debate. 13 News reporter Haley Kosick has more. Marshall University, enrollment just shy of 10,000. Jenkins Hall, one of many educational facilities home to their College of Education and Professional Development students and staff. But the name of the building has caused quite a stir. I want to go into it. In 1937, the building was named after U.S. Confederate General Albert Gladden Jenkins, who lived in Cabell County and owned slaves. Many students on campus were bothered by this and brought it to the university's attention back in April. The university acted, quote, Marshall University President Jerome Gilbert convened an ad hoc committee last spring at the request of a student to review building names on Marshall's campus. The university recently initiated a public comment period where students could submit comments regarding the matter. 13 News went on campus to see how students felt. I think they should change the name, I guess. Yeah. Not really affected me, like to where I'm not able to like come here and learn, but like, I mean, yeah, we can see why we need to change it. It's crazy. Like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, like why that change was, something? That was a long, long time ago. Exactly. It's not like the same like that anymore. And it probably costs money to like change it and yeah. all that stuff. Like, I don't see the point of it. At this time, Jenkins Hall is the only building being considered for a name rechange. Haley Kosick, 13 News, working for you.